The Duck Duck and the Needlefish. The story begins with a small duck duck crawling on the beach, right when a rude needlefish appears. What a beautiful day," said the duck duck. "Ha ha! You're so slow and clumsy. See how fast I move in the water," said the needlefish. "You're fast, and I'm slow. That's true, but I think I can beat you if we have a race along the shore." "You fool! How can you beat me in a race? I am lightning quick, and you're slower than a snail," said the needlefish. "Here's what we'll do." We will start next to this rock and end at the big marsh tree at the other end of the beach. You can swim, and I can crawl on the land," said the duck duck. "Okay, but how am I gonna know where you are? You are so tiny," said the needlefish. "That's easy. Just shout out my name, and I'll yell back," said the duck duck. Later on that night. The duck duck went and called all of his friends and asked them for help. Everyone, everyone, please, you have to help me beat this needlefish in the big race tomorrow. The other duck ducks were confused because the needlefish was so fast; they didn't think it was possible to beat him. Okay, here's the plan: each of you will be set on a spot. And then, whenever the needlefish calls out my name, one of you will answer, and then the needlefish will think that I am ahead of him, and I will be waiting at the finish line," said the duck duck. The duck ducks agreed and started to carve the starting line and the finish line on the rock and the big marsh tree at the other end of the beach. The next morning, the needlefish and the duck duck lined up at the start. "Are you ready, Mr. Needlefish?" Said the duck duck. Of course I am," said the needlefish. The race began, and the needlefish went off at lightning speed across the water. After a while, the needlefish called out, "Duck duck, are you there?" said the needlefish. "Yes, I am. I'm ahead of you," said one of the duck ducks. "What? How is this possible?" said the needlefish. The needlefish grew so angry. He went faster and faster, and then called out a second time. "Duck, duck, where are you?" said the needlefish. "On the shore. I'm still ahead of you." The needlefish was so angry he almost lost his mind. He raced so fast that the water whirled around him. When he reached the marsh tree, the small duck, duck crab was waiting for him. Ah, oh, oh! You're finally here," said the duck duck. The needlefish was so angry that he leaped out of the water and pierced the side of the big morris tree. Ah, ah! Someone, please help! I'm stuck on this big tree," said the needlefish. After hours and hours of struggling, the needlefish finally broke free. But after he broke free, he was covered in the Morris tree sap. The sap was very sour and sticky. This is the reason why the needlefish is very bitter. The end. Drawings were done by Angeline Felicciano. Editing was done by Joseph Green, and voice was done by Lawrence Meliza. <laughs>